There was a knock on the door as my husband of two minutes and I stood in our first private embrace as a married couple. I was told through the door that my mother was demanding my presence. I asked her about that moment recently, asked what was so important, and she didn't remember it had even happened. It was just one of those unique undercurrent moments that pop up at weddings as relationships are rearranged. I'm Colleen Thomas. I'm a ritual artist, and I help people make sense of life through ceremony. This is Shame Pinata. The name of the show comes from a ceremony I created at a time when I was completely deflated and unable to move forward. It felt like I had lost my soul, and the ceremony helped me to find me again. Ritual is wonderful in times when we feel lost. It's also wonderfully adaptive, allowing us to customize traditional ceremonies to meet unique needs. On this first mini-season of Shame Piñata, we will look at the challenges of weddings and commitment ceremonies. I was young and in my 20s, I wanted to just do right by wedding traditions and make sure I didn't mess anything up or, you know, curse our wedding in some way. (laughs) For women, marriage has meant really the death of self. I exist to take care of the man and to take care of the children, and that's it. Some of the things I was taught as a woman um, about my self-worth, about like that I was told that I I was causing men to sin and I was a problem because I was a female and Mm -hmm. an attractive person. Because I'm feeling sad, because I have a sense of loss, because I feel like a part of me is dying, because I'm not over the moon ecstatic. Something must be wrong with me or with my partner or... Um, with the decision to get married, something's wrong. We will hear from people who pressed beyond limitations like these to create original ceremonies that allowed them and their partners to truly shine. So I had this sort of weight, this gravitas of the sense of this millennia is ending and I'm, and I'm committing to myself for the new millennia to not get into drama with men anymore. It was so hard for her not to plan a a wedding. And so she was like, okay, well, we need centerpieces. So I'm going to create these centerpieces and we need a theme. And they kept trying to ask me all these questions. You're feeling sad because you are in a rite of passage. You're feeling sad because you are in the death experience. Letting go of this identity, this primary identity as single person, as daughter, and shifting into an entirely new stage of life and new identity. And there is no way to go through that without feeling grief. On this first season of Shame Pinata, join me to explore how to create a wedding or a commitment ceremony on your own terms. Episode 1 launches February 1st. Be sure to subscribe on Apple Podcasts, Stitcher, Radio Public, or go to shamepinata.com to learn more.